first time here. So, as you all can see, I have finally got my delivery. If you've been following, you know, my last few videos, I've actually been saying that I have a, you know, a major update that's coming and I was waiting for it to, you know, be delivered. And it's actually this table. I purchased it a few months ago. Originally, I wasn't even due to receive it until actually May of this year, but ended up getting it, you know, a few months earlier, thank God. But this is the long awaited table that I've been waiting for to complete my look. I used to have a glass table here a couple years ago, but I ended up, you know, taking it down. I went through a period of not wanting a table. And then, you know, I was thinking about possibly getting a marble table. And then when I came across this, I was like, this is the perfect one. Didn't want nothing too big. And then, you know, I wanted something to kind of like bring out, you know, the remaining of the furniture without it being too matchy matchy as well. Like I have the whites over there and you know, I have plenty of silver. So wanted something to kind of like, you know, match that again. I ended up uh, ordering the table from CB2. Wanted something a little bit more darker in this area as well as I didn't want to do like a, you know, the a boxy looking table because I have a whole lot of clean lines in here, such as my, you know, my sofa, as well as my console table. It's kind of like the clean straight lines and my dining chair. So I wanted something with a different shape to kind of, you know, mix up a lot of the pieces that I currently have. So this is actually like a, can't really tell on camera, but it's almost like a linen textured feel to it. So certainly love it. The only thing is, um, when it did end up coming out the box, there were a couple of uh, chip chip paint areas, so they're gonna end up having to send me a replacement uh, table. But this is later on in the day since the delivery, so I have since tried to kind of like patch up the areas with a little bit of touch up paint, but I'm still gonna end up getting a whole new table. But in the meantime, it's not really noticeable, so it will you know be okay until I get the table you know a few months from now. But I am, you know, super excited and I just feel like it, it certainly pulls the entire space together without it feeling, you know, too cluttered because that was my concern to not want to get something too, too big. But at the same time, I'm not going to be in this place, you know, forever. So I wanted to go ahead and get something that I know that I'll be happy with, you know, when I move, you know, to another home, whether it be a, you know, a smaller space like this or a larger space, you know, this is something that will, you know, pretty much look good anywhere. As far as the core goes, I don't want to do too much to it accessory wise. You know, it is a statement piece all in itself. I'm going to show you how I'm going to style it in the meantime. Now, if you recall, I had a video where I just recently did a Target haul and I showed you all this particular plate in the Target haul and I told you I'm going to do something with it. So I'm going to actually show you what I'm going to do with this plate. And it's almost, you can kind of like, they have some dupe, this, I would say this is a dupe to the plates that they have in Restoration Hardware and a lot of the other high-end stores. So I'm gonna just show you how to just achieve a real simple look without doing too much with a tart plate. So this is the plate. I actually meant tray. And if you all also recall, I purchased this Geo from Home Goods a couple of months ago, this big large one. So I was intending on waiting until I got my table in order to put the Geo on top of the, you know, the plate. And this is just, you know, a real simple look. I may eventually add a coffee table book here and I'm going to do another video just showing you other, you know, coffee table style and ideas, you know, with this simple look. But in the meantime, this is all I'm going to do. You know, I have enough blacks, whites, grays. So I figured this pop of bronze would kind of like, you know, break all that up. I do plan on also getting, you know, a new light fixture that will kind of like tie in with this. So I'll be doing that, you know, in another video or so. Once I, you know, I get that in, I'll show you how that looks. But again, if I decided to change, you know, change the geo, it's so many different, you know, things that I can do as far as styling, you know, just this plate alone. You know, if I wanted to add, you know, maybe like some ch uh, the chain links that I showed you all in the uh, home goods haul. So again, right now I'm gonna just leave it just like this because it's a nice, simple look. Did not want to put too many accessories because as you see, I have a console table with accessories on it. I have, you know, stuff above my fireplace. 
So I don't want it, like I said, I don't want it to look overly cluttered. The, the table in itself, like I was saying, is a statement piece. So that is pretty much it for today's video. I will be doing an updated video again, showing you how to style some of those pieces that I purchased in previous hauls. And, you know, giving the idea as far as, you know, again, how to style your coffee table if you have one. Also, if you have not yet hit that subscribe button, please don't forget to do so before you all leave. And I will catch you all in the next one. Bye.